हेलो वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल ब्रश एंड पेजली आई एम रक्षा सोनी एंड आई लव टू डू ड्राइंग एंड पेंटिंग आई होप यू कैन फॉलो एंड ड्रॉ अलॉन्ग विथ मी लेट्स बिगिन एंड स्टार्ट ड्राइंग टुडे वी विल बी मेकिंग ए फ्लेमिंगो लेट्स बिगिन ऑलमोस्ट टुवर्ड्स द सेंटर ऑफ द पेज लीव सम स्पेस ऑन द टॉप एंड मेक couple of lines first going upwards and then you will be curving on the other side once you have that then you will be making a curvy line going upwards then you change the direction you go to the other side and then you make an s curve means you are diagonally going down and then you will be curving up like this okay so this is one side of the neck now we will be working on the face so you will be curving inside then making a curve and going along with the line you have created earlier and at the bottom here you start going little bit wider okay so neck is slightly wider here so when you are curving this inside you will be making it slightly wider means that distance is more here and when you are going up then it's getting thinner and then you are going parallel here the beak is very long okay so what we will do we will be making a reverse c shape like this and also from the other side first we are going straight and then we are making a curve going and touching the beak on the other side then you see this point so we will be separating the beak by creating a center line so this is like j kind of curve right and then we can make the eye a circle if you want you can make a double line around that let's make the body okay so you will be making this curve you extend the line going up making a curve started going on the other direction then you will do zigzag kind of curve you again go slightly curve and down and then you will move backwards and a third curve going down like this okay so let me repeat the steps so you created one s curve over here you extend it making a curve going on the other side turning back making a curve again and then move backwards and start making a curvy line diagonal going down and making this curve so this is one side and for the other side we will extend this line little bit then go slightly down and then we go up again making a curve and towards the end we will be making couple of zigzags and ending like that before we start doing the details inside and make feathers we will be working on the legs Okay so flamingos have very very long legs and we will start with two curvy lines and it like this this is this is glass kind of shape wider at the top narrow at the bottom but sides are slightly curvy okay then we go one line slightly diagonal making it bigger for the join and then again straight okay we will make another line next to that same way 
center is slightly curvy and then you go again and at this point you can make a curve going on the right hand side and then you will be making three sharp edges coming out like that and making a line okay so this is one leg and this flamingo is walking so for the other side what you can do you can make a diagonal line make it double line in the center it will be slightly curvy like this and then you can move this on the right hand side to show this flamingo is walking okay this is double line and then the foot is little bit relaxed but still has three points coming out and then you will be joining with the line over here okay so this is your uh, outlines for the flamingo we can still make some feathers here okay so one will be so this is a dividing line so this top side the feathers are going in this direction and we can make one curve over here like this okay the second one you will start making curve going down and then again go and touch the line over here and you will be making up to here like we will be making feathers going in the same direction okay so these are the feathers here and the third row we will be making feathers coming from here this ending line and then turning on the other side like this so this is the shape of the flamingo and it's ready to color but before we color let's make a separating line over here so we can color this in black. 